Happy Saturday, guys. Um, it is Little Miss Press, formerly, formerly Trailer Park Barbie. I'm coming to you with this insane news clip, thanks to High, um, High Impact, <laughs> High High Net Impact Flix is his name. I don't know. I'll write it in the description. Go subscribe to him. But this is insane. Listen at this. Kind of caught my eye. I wasn't going to deal with it, but I wanted to present it to you because it's kind of the state of our world today. It is the new abnormal. Mother 38 is arrested in front of her children and locked in a cell for seven hours after calling. Here's what she did. What was her crime? What was her crime? She, remember sticks and stones may break my bones, but names will never hurt me. Her crime was the reason she was kidnapped in front of her children, arrested, and thrown into a cage, and life probably ruined. If her workplace finds out what happens to her, happened to her, she'll probably lose her job. She called a transgender woman a man on Twitter. Wow. Her mother was arrested in front of her children and locked up for seven hours after referring to a transgender woman as a man online. Three officers, three officers detained Kate, Kate Scotto at her home before quizzing her at a police station about an argument with an activist on Twitter over so-called dead naming. The 38-year-old from Hitchin, Hertfordshire, had her photograph, DNA, and fingerprints taken and remains under investigation. I wonder if they put that swab thing down into the back of her nose. More than two wow. years after her arrest on December 1st, she has had neither her mobile phone nor her laptop returned, which she says is hampering her studies for a master's in forensic psychology. Writing on online forum Mumsnet, Mrs. Scotto, who has also been served with a court order that bans her from referring to her accuser as a man, claimed, I mean, so, so here we go. Uh, the person is really biologically a male, but wants to be... Uh, viewed and addressed as a female. So what what's happening here is the authorities have been uh, have gotten involved, have arrested a woman who has children simply because she refused to buy into somebody else's. You know, in the words of Ben Shapiro, del delusion. Remember when Ben Shapiro was sitting next to, uh, gosh, who was it? Who was that? Who was the? Who was the person? Wow, guys. Oh my God, more craziness, more craziness in the news. And if you're on the twatter, please be careful. This could be you. Maybe remember to not misgender somebody. And this guy is high, impla high impact flicks, this guy's name. Anyways, have a great Saturday. Love y'all.